let us understand a special iterator called list iterator here is the same example of a list containing three strings sam prasad and sumed we know that using normal iterator you can traverse these elements in forward direction but you can't traverse the elements in reverse direction that's where you can use list iterator it supports bidirectional access to the elements of the list list iterator provides additional methods to allow reverse traversal so we have methods like has previous previous and previous index which can be used to move backward inside the list we will study how to use these methods during the hands on session we are back in the eclipse workspace in this hands on session we will learn how to use list iterator with the linked list let's open the project collections it contains the package collections 2 and inside that there is a java program linked list demo dot java let's open it it contains certain guidelines for writing the code so overall we want to learn how to use a linked list implementation we also want to learn the most commonly used operation of the list iterator first of all the initial steps if you see like adding elements printing the list etc these uh, steps are quite common whether you are using array list or linked list so let's go to our earlier program array list demo which we completed in the earlier hands on and let's copy a part of the code where we define the list and add elements to it and let's come back and let's paste it here right now let's change the definition of the variable my list so that we create an instance of linked list like this after that let's go through the copy pasted code so first we are adding couple of strings to the list using add method so we are adding john and mike then we are using the add method this time of the linked list where we supply the index so we add ron at index 1 after that let's dump the current contents of the list so initial contents of my list are dumped to the console using system dot out dot println so as you can see these are the generic operations provided by the list interface itself and hence they will work with linked list as well now let's uh, try to use the list iterator list iterator provides some interesting functionality so let's first declare the variable of type list iterator so here is our list iterator of string my iter equal to my list dot list iterator so using the list iterator method of my list we get hold of the list iterator now we can uh, move the iterator forward so let's do that using the next function provided by the list iterator my iter dot next my iter dot next 